Hi Leo, this is Tracy from Northeast Tarot and welcome to your weekly tarot forecast for the week of August 29th through September 4th. This is for Leo Sun, Leo Moon, and Leo Rising signs. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, Leo, I have the Ace of Swords. So the Ace of Swords can be victory after going down a very long road with lots of challenges. The Ace of Swords is also that clarity, that communication coming through, cutting to the truth of the matter, hearing the truth, speaking your truth. It can represent you signing contracts. Let's see here. The overall energy, Leo, is the Nine of Wands. And the Nine of Wands is re you really hanging in there. There's something that you want, Leo, and you're not gonna give in. You're not gonna fold. This is you really hanging in there and being quite persistent. You're persevering. But it is you having to wait. Um, waiting on that signed contract, waiting on that communication, waiting on this victory. But I do see this victory coming um, with the Ace of Swords. Now, for some of you, you're receiving that communication that you've been waiting on. Let me pull you another card. I feel the need to just draw one more card for clarification. Okay, we have the Ace of Pentacles. So now we have the Ace of Swords and we also have the Ace of Pentacles. So waiting on maybe something to do with a new job, a new home. With the Ace of Pentacles, it's a solid new beginning, something that's gonna add security and, and stability to your life. So for some of you, this is a new home. For other, others, this is a new job. Or maybe an inheritance, something um, connected to assets or finances. Uh, we are starting out with the Six of Cups, which is that nostalgic energy. So for some of you, you might feel nostalgic. You might be thinking about the past a lot. Um, but also this week, someone or something from your past could be uh, coming up or, or relevant. Um, there could be maybe a fire sign person. Uh, another fi fire sign person that's quite significant. Uh, for some of you, this will be someone from your past that's maybe popping up quite suddenly with the Knight of Wands here. The Knight of Wands represents that forward moving energy. So things happening quickly or suddenly. Uh, I do feel like for many of you, this is you being incredibly ambitious, fiery, passionate um, about someone or something from your past. Also, the Six of Cups can represent children. So maybe you've been trying to move to a new home, um, to move you and your, your children to a new home, and this is something you've been waiting on. Um, I do feel like for many of you, this is talking about a home. Uh, if not, maybe move up within the company that you work for or move towards a new, a new position, a new job. For some of you, you're waiting on communication from someone or something from your past. Maybe you've applied uh, for a certain position and you're waiting on that communication waiting to be able to charge forward. With the Page of Wands, this is incredibly positive, exciting communication, but normally uh, it's communication that we're expecting, communication that we have to wait for. So for some of you, you're, you're hanging in there, you're, you're waiting on that communication that you know is going to come through. Let me just see here. I think that for some of you, you felt a lack or, or was losing faith with this communication, um, maybe feeling a lack financially or feeling a lack of support or a lack of something within your life or just simply losing faith, feeling down and out uh, because this communication hasn't come through yet, because you're waiting for such a long period of time. Uh, in regards to this communication. And this communication could absolutely be a decision because we also have the lover's card here. A decision from your lover or 
a decision that you've been waiting on in regards to this Ace of Pentacles. Losing faith with this decision. Losing faith with this partnership. Losing faith with this communication. But this is coming. This is coming. With the Ace of Swords and the Sun here, oh, it's coming. Um, I think that overall you're going to be shining bright, Leo, this week. It's a great week to get outdoors. I think there's going to be a lot of people very attracted to your energy this week, Leo. Uh, you could very well be in the spotlight in some way. So for some of you, this is going to be within your career. And maybe that past position that you did apply for, uh, you could be hearing something about that this week. And it's because you're shining bright um, that maybe, you know, a manager or whomever, you know, really notices you and says, oh, wait, I need to contact her or I need to contact him. Now, with the Lovers card here and the Six of Cups, there definitely could be something happening within a relationship for some Leos, a business partnership, or a friendship. Um, for some of you, maybe you've been waiting on a decision from your partner. Whether or not maybe they want to commit or take this relationship to the next level, because diagonal from the Lovers, I have the Four of Wands. And the Four of Wands really represents that security, that stability, you know, within a relationship, um, something that's going to last for many years to come and just add a great deal of, of stability and security to your life. And this is also happiness as well. I think that for some of you, you've been waiting to maybe move in with your partner or waiting for the relationship to move to the next level. But I feel like that communication, that, that decision, that choice is, is coming. It's coming through. We have the Emperor here, which is you being successful, uh, Leo. This is an empowering energy. You moving towards more stability in your life. Bringing in more stability, more security into your life. Um, but also, this can be you taking control. Um, Yeah, speaking your truth. I feel like for some of you, this could be you taking control, speaking your truth with maybe someone from your past or with a partner here. For some of you, maybe you're making the decision to sever ties from a friendship or a relationship or even a business partnership that's no longer serving you. I think that for some of you, you're you know sick of feeling down and out. And with the emperor, you know, this is you taking back your controller or feeling empowered and taking control of a situation. And with the ace of swords, you definitely could be releasing or cutting ties from things that are no longer serving you. Uh, speaking your truth. And charging forward passionately. Um... Overall, I see it actually being a great week for you, Leo. I, th I think that you feel amazing. I think that you feel empowered. It's a great week to spend time with family, friends, to have family over to your home, to get outdoors, to spend time outside in the sunshine, to maybe go to the beach. Definitely, I see a lot of Leos traveling. You're out and about. I really feel like a more social energy this week. Emotionally, I see you being in a really good place. I think that whatever this is, you're really uh, taking control of this. Whatever this is, you're taking actions to eliminate whatever was getting you down. For some, let me pull you an additional guidance card, Leo. Some additional guidance for Leo for this upcoming week. What else does Leo need to know? Please show me. So financially, I think it's going to be a great week. You have you have opportunities coming in. Emotionally, I think it's a great week. <laughs> we, we did just enter into a, a time of Mercury retrograde. So for some of you, there could be someone from your past returning. This could be another fire sign like yourself. And then for others, this could be a Gemini. Definitely could be an Aries. All right, we have a card that just flipped out. 
Very nice. We have Mystique. Keep charging ahead and don't take no for an answer. Expect miraculous solutions to appear. So just keep hanging in there, Leo, and that's exactly what you're doing with the Nine of Wands. So just keep going, keep charging ahead. Spirit is telling you that you will receive those solutions. Um, expect miraculous solutions to appear. Okay. So Leo, I do hope that you found this reading helpful and I hope you have a great week. Take care.